Hey guys, Cindy out here with my RT Endeavors. How are you doing? I'm doing pretty good. Um, this week, get all my stuff here untangled. I love this. It's all chunky and all clunky. Uh, this week we're working on our ABCs, or I should say today we're working on our ABCs for chronic pain. And we are at J. We are at the letter J. So, here we go. Um, I went into my scrap box and I just pulled out a bunch of junk. See? J for junk. <laughs> um, and this came off of Flow Magazine, I think. Yeah, that's exactly what that is. Um, what we're going to do is we are going to start playing with our tag. Now, so this week we've got J. And, you know, I really didn't have that many um, difficulties coming up with the words for the letter J because um, I happen to deal with quite a few of them. Um, and I'll tell you what the words are. And I have jolt. I have jerk. I wonder if I should do that over. No, let's not do that. Um, I have jolt. I have jerk. Meaning, not meaning like a jerk but like my muscles jerk um i've got jar and i'll tell you why i have jar in a minute and i have jumping now a lot of this has to do with my muscle spasms um, my legs are always jerking and jarring meaning that all of a sudden my leg will just kick out or um, i'll have just twitches and jerks and spasms and it's just crazy and, you know, unfortunately, there's nothing I can do about it other than, you know, try to try to not go crazy. So, um, let's see what else I've got here. Oh, I've got this one. That looks pretty cool, doesn't it? Let's choose this. Um, this was actually on an old prescription, and um, it was jelly printing. And this one, actually, I think my friend Carla jelly printed. So anyways, that's our J words. Now, um, you know, I'm sure you guys, as you think about whatever illness or whatever, um, you know, disability you may have, you might come up with additional words that works for your situation, but those are the ones that work for mine. And with those words, I, um, I live with it daily. Uh, I don't have a day. Matter of fact, I'm going to say I don't even have an hour when I'm not having muscle spasms. As I sit here right now, I'm having muscle spasms. Only this time they're in the cheeks of my butt. So it, it just seems like my nerves and my muscles just don't know what to do anymore. They're constantly jerking, they're constantly jarring, they're, <laughs> they're constantly, um, you know, jumping. And when it comes to the jolt, when I talk about having a jolt, that is um electricity is the only way i can describe it i will get these jolts down my legs like i'm having electric jolts put through it it's really really strange so yeah those are my j words um like i said i'm sure you guys will be able to come up with more and you know i can't wait to hear them because we all have different situations not where my hole is right there I just try to get it back pretty much in that hole that it was in to begin with. So close enough. Close enough. Actually, I got it right on it. All right, so those are my J words. Now, what are we going to do with this? Hmm. Let's think, Cindy. Um, of course, I'm going to use that. I think I want to, let's put some texture on here. Not exactly sure what I'm doing with this tag today, so this is just kind of, I'm going with what feels right. And I just decided I wanted some of this texture on there, so it feels right. It's going to happen. I'm not looking for a certain pattern, or I'm just putting it on wherever I feel like doing it. So, there's another spot. Let's put one right there. And let's stick one right there. 
All right, so I've got some of that. I love these circles. I think these circles are really cool. Dots, whatever you want to call them. Circles, dots. I'm really bummed. I'm all out of um, tape for my label maker. And I've been getting, so I like using that a lot in my projects. <laughs> I'm really bummed. I either have to order some from Amazon or I have to go somewhere tomorrow and get some. Ugh. What do you think I'll be doing? Hmm. How much do I bet I order it from Amazon? <laughs> That's one thing also I can tell you. Um, when you're dealing with this type of a chronic pain and you guys, I, I, you're all going to start shaking your heads. I know you are. Um, you don't... You don't want to go anywhere. Uh, to be honest with you, going out is exhausting. Um, I'm getting to the point where I just as soon stay home. All right, what else are we going to put on here? Let's find something else. Let's get out. I got a drawer, a drawer here of just stuffs. So let's see. We're going to have to put our words on here. But what can we put? That's cool. What can, else can we put in here besides our words? Um, doo -doo -doo. I'm just digging to see what I can find in here. I wonder if I could, it'd be nice if I could find like a, oh, you know what? This will be perfect. Oh, let me see if I can get one from the side. There we go. Because my legs are the ones that are always have the problems with. Always. So I'm actually going to use those legs on this page. What else can I use? Again, I'm just digging. Um, bring this over so you guys can see what I'm actually doing here. I'm just digging. Tip that up. I'm just looking to see what I can find that, you know, might go. That's kind of cool. That actually is a piece from um, Ann Williamson. I used part of it in another project. So yeah, that's what this is. This is just a drawer full of things. That's kind of cool. We'll use that on there. Just things. Um, oh, here's a border. That looks kind of cool. You know, and I'll do this. I'll go and I'll dig a bunch of stuff out. Sometimes I'll use it. Sometimes I won't. Sometimes I'll just throw it all back in here and say, yeah, I don't want to go that way. But I like that pretty flower, but I don't want to cover up all that. Nope. So, yeah, that's all I'm doing is I'm just digging <laughs> to find. And this is the stuff you guys normally don't see me do. Usually I try to get all the stuff out and just have it all ready. And But today I'm in a digging mood. Oh, that's cute. I'll use that on there. Huh, I have, these are my ink flowers I was doing. They're cool. I'll have to use them on a page someday. Anyways, um... And then I'll just kind of flip it back this way. Oh, there's another one that I might not like that on there. What's this feather? No. There's no. Nope. Pink. So, and then I'll just kind of flip it back the other way. Because sometimes you can. Oh, there's another one. You can, I, you know, go through stuff that um, I've missed. I don't like that one on there. So yeah, this is how I figure out what's going to go on my pages. And this is how I just scoop through stuff and say, huh, that's kind of pretty. I will put that on the other side. We'll see, leave that out. All right. All right, so I think I've, oh, here's some washi. Let's see what's in this one. Oh, and there's a, we'll use that. All right. See what's in this washi. So this is what I've dug out, which is right here. I've got those four pieces and some washi and actually six pieces. So let's see what we've got in here. That's kind of cool. 
All right, um, so as I was saying, you know, my issue is with my legs, um, you know, with the muscle spasms. So I'm not sure what else you guys may find um, for your J words. You know, and again, each individual person is different. So you may come up with, you know, something totally different than I do. Just one side, I don't want to stay out. And, you know, I enjoy playing with these tags. I just, I like having fun with the tags. Um, it's a great way to use up stuff. And it also just gives me a chance to sit here and chat with you guys and, you know, talk about this chronic pain journey. So, let's see. Oh my gosh, the other day, I don't know, some of you may know this, but um, my husband's retired. And a while ago, he was talking about journaling. And I said, you can journal any time. And he's like, well, once I retire, I said, no, just start it now. So he actually started doing some some forms of art journaling. It's not, um, he's not into it every day, just every now and then when he feels like it, he'll come in and he'll mess around in a, an art journal. Well, <laughs> the other day he was showing me a page he was doing and asking me how I liked it. And I really liked it. And he had these two pieces that he was going to put down. And I said, well, you're going to cut that white away. And uh, he's like, well, he goes, I I've tried and I'm not really good at it. I said, well, give it to me and I'll cut it away. He goes, are you sure you can do that? I'm like, yeah. So I actually, what I did is I used this pair of scissors and it's a Tim Holtz and it's their tiny pair. And um, the other day when I went down to his shop, I bought another pair of them. So I got it all done and I, I looked, I said, what scissors do you have? And he showed me he had this great big pair, kind of like this. I'm like, yeah, no, you can't do fussy cutting with that. So I handed him the other pair. Oh my gosh, he's like, oh, I love these scissors. They're so good, much better. I'm like, yeah. So anyways, that made him happy. But that was completely off topic. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm just keeping you guys company while I sit here and fussy cut this. Come on. I like these legs. So yeah, this is where, I don't like that white right there. I want that white gone. Much better. And let's get rid of this white and this white. Much better. Mucho. So yeah, um, like I said, jerk and jolt and jump and jiminy jiminy. That's what I look forward to every day. And it happens at night. I'll get woke up right straight out of a sleep um, if I get to sleep, which I haven't been doing a lot of lately, and I'm not quite sure why. But uh, I'll get woken right straight up out of a sound sleep. And it's just my legs just decide that, I don't know, I'm not supposed to sleep, I guess. And they just keep a lot of muscle spasms. And that's after taking a muscle relaxer, so... Um, I like this on here. I might put that right. Uh, do I want just that? Yeah, I like that. I'm going to put that there. I love this. This little guy's going to go on here somewhere. I think he just needs to go right there. Just because. And I love this, but I don't see where it fits in here. So, this is going to be a pretty simple tag. And uh, I'm happy with it, so that's a good thing. Here's my glue. Oops, and there's no top on it. I have a habit of doing that. I will use my glue and then not, not put the top back on. Whoops, come back here, you. All right. I'm wondering if I should have darkened the edges of that a little bit. But, we'll have to work on that. Okay, now I'm going to put this on right there. I like it. Alright, and we're going to put our little jumpy legs on here. And you know, just because um, of the simplicity of the tag, I really don't want to 
I'll put it just like that. I really don't want to um, color those legs, so I'm not going to. I'm going to leave them black and white. Yeah, I like it. All right, and I'm just going to put this on here because I can, and I think it looks cool. Why not? You know, we have all this stuff in our stashes, and, you know, why not use it? I'm to the point where I just, I want to use this stuff. I think there for a while I was, you know, holding on to it and thinking, oh, I don't want to, you know, I only have so many of those and I don't want to use it. Yeah, not anymore. Now I'm like, what can I do with it? How can I use it? And I'm just kind of sketchy sketching the, something stuck to me, um, these circles just because I can. Why not? Oops, and that one I over sketchy sketched, but that's okay. Look at that, that one was right there in the middle. <laughs> that's funny. All right, so now what I'm going to do is we are going to write down our words. We've got jolt, we've got jar. We have jumping and jerk. Let's see, jumping. And we have jerk. And again, those aren't meant to be derogatory in any way. I need something right here, don't I? Hmm. What can I put there? Let me think for a second. And I have this little box of stickers. I use these all the time in my journaling. Um, I just thought, no bunny. Oh, let's see. Here's a kitty cat. New. Mm. Ah, <laughs> he's cute. He's a little crying penguin. Yep, he's going to go on here just because he's cute. But I'm going to cut a bunch of this white off him, so maybe it'll make him a little bit smaller. Doo-doo! Just gonna kind of cut him so he's sitting there. All right, so here's my little <laughs> crying penguin. Come on. I know you're a sticker. I know you're a sticker. It's there, I just have to get a hold of it. Sorry guys. All right, where's my pokey tool? My pokey tool, I can get the layers apart just like that. <laughs> He's cute. Don't you agree? Isn't he cute? <laughs> He's cute. All right, so here's our backside. I love it. I love just the way it is. Perfect. Let's go to our front side. I'm going to leave this here. Hmm. And give me a second. I need to figure out what I'm going to do on this front side. And I'll be right back. Okay, you guys are going to think I'm crazy. I'm sitting here and I'm looking at this and I'm like, hmm, what am I going to do for my good J's? <laughs> it dawned on me. Look at the background. Do you know what that is? Actually, it's a stencil. But, um, and I, then I looked over at my list of words that I have for my J's. And what's the first word? Journaling. I, you know, I have said it over and over and over again. Um, I journal. And I journal a lot. Um... And you know, when I get woke up in the middle of the night and I don't have enough sleep and 
the the jumping and all of that just continues and it drives me insane I love this let me take this I don't want it so thick though if you ever get these cardboard things like this you can always just take like the printed part off the front but anyways what I was saying is when I you know if I don't get enough sleep or I really have issues with um, you know something that's going on with my body my journal hears all about it um, my journal is is my safe haven it's my place to go it's it just it's a huge help to me and I can't say it enough you know um, it's my safe place and I got that a little bit thinner so I am going to I love this I just think it's so cool so I want to put it on here um, but I want to put it on here and then I also want to put some journaling spots on here so I can actually journal let me I'm gonna cut this white off here because I can I love some of these dyes I just hate the fact they have all this white on them on the white edges sometimes they're okay but most of the time I'm cutting the white edges off just because it annoys me to have that white edge like that. I want to see the item. I don't want to see all white the whole way around it. Right? I don't know how many times you guys have seen me do this. Eh, it is what it is. So yeah. Um, I'll get up the next morning, usually after I have my coffee and or with my coffee, and I will just start journaling. And when I do journal, I um, just get out the frustration. You know, I may talk about my day the day before, or I may talk about something special that's going on, or that kind of thing. But um, journaling, journaling is my friend. And another thing that um, for the J's, and I know this is very, very difficult to do, especially when you're having um, so much pain and so many issues, is look at this I found this piece of paper in my stash um, is to try and stay joyful <laughs> I say that <laughs> lightly because I know how hard it is I know how hard it is to um, I cut that really weird I know how hard it is to want to get up in the morning and just be grumpy. I get it. I totally get it. Been there, done that. But I have found that when I spend more time being joyful or happy, I'm just going to put little blocks on here because I want to put some stuff on here. Um, I found that my life is a little bit easier. And you know what? They don't even have to be. They don't have to be the right size, do they? Nope. I'm just making sure they each have a pink line in them. I don't know why, but I am. But yeah, um, it's difficult, but try and be joyful. You know, make the best. I think that what I'm trying to say is just make the best of every day. That's actually what I'm going to put on here is make the best of every day. Um, because that's really all you can do. Um, if you try to, you know, if you don't try, you just get really grumpy. And, and life is hard. Life's tough enough as it is. Why make it tougher on yourself? Let's get glue on it. We'll flip it over. Uh, why make it tougher on yourself than it already is? So, you know, try your best to see um, the good. Is it easy? No, it's not easy. I know that. But uh, just try. That's all you can do. Alright, so try. Your best. Actually make the best of every day. 
So I'm just gluing these on here and then I'm going to write on them and then I'll do some outlining. Make the best of every day. Right? Because really, what else can we do? Be grumpy all day every day. I don't want to be that way. My life is much more fun when I'm happy. What's that? Oh, nothing. Alright, so let me grab... Okay, so we're just going to do make the best of every day. And I'm going to put on here journaling. Let's see, where can I put it? Um, and I'm going to put joyful. Because really, you know, that's what we've got. So I'm just going to kind of outline this a little bit. So really, you know, not a lot of a message on the J's, but, um, you know, take away from it what you will. And, uh, you know, as always, I hope you guys enjoy these. Let me just, i got to grab some fiber for this one. Let's see what we have. How about some of this? Maybe. Well, I can't find the end of it, so I'll just cut it. We're going to use some of that today, this, this fiber. And my fiber is underneath my desk because I found that's the easiest place for me to get a hold of it. All right. So I can't wait to see what you guys come up with for your J words. Um, you know, I hope you find some interesting ones because, you know, it's kind of difficult to think about the J's. That was one of my harder ones. But like I said, I hope you guys enjoy this. And as always, um, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe and give me a thumbs up and have fun. That's what life's all about and happy creating. And I will see you next week. Take care. Bye.